inclement weather. Yeah, conditions. inclement weather kept us away from uh, this desk, but here we are, stronger and rested. And it is crazy cold out. It really is. We're talking about goalies today. Goalies. And always crazy. Always crazy. Pretty much as a rule, your goalie is an insane person. But probably, would you say the most protected position in sports? Or would you go that far? Uh, Maybe quarterback might Quarterback be. is But well I don't protected. know. But the quarterbacks Guys, are like protected by the league like really heavily. Yeah. Whereas like, quarterbacks get hit still, though. Yeah. The only goalie in the NHL that gets hit is Ryan Miller. <laughs> but probably not anymore. No. Probably would never happen twice. It kind of did. <laughs> I think that happened too. Jordan Tutu, like a couple of weeks after, yeah, yeah. hit him. Do you need an elite goalie to win the Stanley Cup? To, to make it to the Stanley Cup? To go deep in the playoffs, I guess. The Chicago Blackhawks won the Stanley Cup with Antti Niemi. Yes. They also won with, with Corey Crawford. Corey Crawford. Who is someone that I think is now arguable if he's an elite goalie? Right, maybe. I don't. I don't know if I'd call him one. I don't know if I would but either. But he a, has a cup. But he has a cup, and he he did it with a team that had won a cup with another goalie who wouldn't call. Yeah. That. Henrik Lundqvist, no cup. Jonathan Quick, two, those cups. Two cup. Those two cups. cups. Por favor. <laughs> I feel like Jonathan Quick doesn't get called an elite goaltender. But I think he, yeah. he is. I think I mean, he's carried that team a few times. If he's not elite, I think he's on the cusp of it. So then who who would be elite in the NHL? Lundqvist? I think Lundqvist. Pekka uh, Rene? Yeah, I mean... Carey Price? You could... Yeah, you could... You could argue Rene, I think. Because he's had an amazing season. And he's been good other seasons, but... Like, I think he's been really good other seasons with a team in front of him that's garbage. Right. Or not, not, right. not as good as they are this year, for sure. Nashville's kind of been one of those teams that just hasn't been able to, like, go to the the show. Make yeah. it to the show, you know? Well, and they're, they're currently top in the NHL. Yeah. And they're a team that, if something doesn't... If, you know, the offense doesn't show up for a game, mm-hmm. they have a good defense and they have a, a great goaltender. Right. I bought a shirt... And he took my my change and stared at me and put it in his tip jar. And then I stared at him <laughs> and I took it out. Uh. <laughs> Carey Price, I think, is arguably the best goalie right now. Because he's taken the Canadians, who are my team. I'm a Canadians fan. He is. And um, he's taken that team, which it is currently number one in the NHL. Mm-hmm. And probably shouldn't be a number one in the NHL team. They have talent. That's true. I mean, and but Carey Price has been like incredible. Yeah. What about someone like L- L- Roberto Luongo? What do you think about that? What's, he's what's hard. Going he's on such there? a hard one to say because he's had so many ups and downs. There's years where he looks unbeatable, right? And then there's years where no cup though, right? No cup. So no. got close with Vancouver, and the city burnt down. <laughs> yeah, yeah, they weren't happy. A team that could be done in by their goaltender is a team like. Like Tampa Bay. Um, they're a really good team, but their goaltender's not proven. I'm not saying Bishop's not a good goalie. No. But he hasn't done a lot, and we don't know what he's going to do in a playoff situation. He might be fantastic, or he might crum- crumble under the pressure. And they have a young team in general, too. So yeah. there's a lot of talent on that team. And, I mean, there's no denying that. You can see it when you watch them play. They're fast, and they just are a good hockey team. Mm-hmm. So Mark Andre Fleury, I'll just go for it. Yeah, do right it now. Hit it right it's now. It's on. It's recording. Uh, he's a guy that is another one that you can people always discuss. Is he an elite? Isn't he? I would. I would say no, personally, and I mean, just I just right for it. Yeah. Well, I I think that, I mean, his crashes in the playoffs. Have kind of. I mean, they've been legendary. But that's it. I think that's a case where because he does have a, a cup, right? So like, yeah. but I think that's a case where like the team in front of him was so good. Yeah. That like. Like unbelievable. Look at these things. Look at that. Like you, you'd think I had something in my shirt. 
Look at... Look. There's always that goalie that like comes out of nowhere or whatever and like maybe has a great season or yeah. a great couple seasons. Like I think of like Bobrovsky. And, yeah. Like he won the Vesna. Um, he's great. Like I don't know if he's elite. Like yeah, he, no. he had that great season. Tim Thomas too. Tim Thomas, I would yeah yeah and he then he had a couple of great seasons. Yeah, there's goalies who look like they're gonna be great and they just never turn out. Like you, there it's probably one of the hardest positions to draft for. Yeah, just why you very seldom, very seldomly see a number one pick goalie. Yeah, I think Mark Andre Fleury was he the was. last one. And look how that turned out. Like not really bad. <laughs> <laughs> you know, oh, God, dude, <laughs> you know what's you know something. I hate goalies. Do you need an elite goalie to to win the Stanley Cup? I my okay. I'll let you answer in a second. You go one second. I don't think you do. I think you need a well balanced team and a good goalie. But I don't think you need that elite goalie. If you if you have a crappier team, I think you need an elite goalie. I don't know that you need an elite goalie. Um, I think you need. <laughs> Um, I think you need a hot goalie and a good team. Good team. Good, great team. Great team to good, win the Stanley Cup. Good teams don't win the Stanley Cup. Great no. teams win the Stanley Cup. Sorry, could you say that again? I took the mic away from you. <laughs> good teams don't win the Stanley Cup. Great teams win the Stanley Cup. Agreed. The Puck Buddies.